we always loved playing derby games when we were young and we just really wanted to make our own game, give it our own twist and see what we can make with it. The Unity multiplayer functionality is really cool for our game because it's really fun to play against uh, bots, play against artificial intelligence, but it's much more fun to play against real players. So when you actually smash someone's real car, you're like, yeah, that's it. <laughs> We followed the Unity UNET uh, from its start uh, in the er earliest versions that was available. And always when we were making uh, network code, we found out there was some sort of feature that was missing in Unity. But almost literally the next day, there would be an updated Unity that did contain that new feature. So thankfully, we really, really, really needed the updates and it came really quickly. The Unity community really helped us with fixing problems. We had so many little problems with making uh, network code and they were always really helpful. Uh, we always uh, looked into Stack Overflow and the Unity forums uh, and on pretty much 9 out of 10 times we always found a solution. In the beginning we had 200 concurrent players and we thought that should be enough. Uh, so just to make sure we raised our CCU cap to 1000. Uh, but funnily enough within a week we were up to 5000, uh, which was way more than our cap. But Unity, uh, the Unity team always made it really easy for us to uh, raise the bar. We could go to 5,000 CCU, no problem. <laughs>